May 25th of this year, the Monday before that, I had found out that I had cancer. I was going in to my colorectal surgeon for what I thought was an imaging appointment or a CAT scan to see if the cancer had spread anywhere else. So that's terrifying, but on the bright side, Killian's here. Yeah! yeah. Say what up. Yeah. We get to the doctor's office. We're kind of goofing around in the room, trying to keep it light. <laughs> I know. Okay, so usually when I come to this doctor's office, I'm here to get a shot of my hemorrhoid up from someone's face. Oh, hello. Doctor comes in, sees Killian there, and makes a remark of the idea that I'm a weirdo for bringing my brother. This is my brother, Killian. You guys are wonder we got screwed up. I know. We're not, we're not on the same page at all. I just decided to come out with it because he was just kind of sitting there looking at me awkwardly, and I was like, okay, so. I don't really know what we're doing today. Would you just tell me about a little bit about what about what you're gonna do? What are you doing? Uh, um, well, you've got hemorrhoids that we've been injecting. Uh huh. What you mean? No, 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 no. Um, did you talk to my? Did you talk to the other? Uh, to doctor? Oh, that. Now I know what's going on. Yes. I, when I saw your name this morning, I think I said I like I remember that from somewhere. Uh huh. Okay. Now it's coming clear. What has he told you? And so I rattle off the whole thing about what's going on, and then he just jumps right into, why don't you do the most extreme thing possible that you could, without ever having looked at what I've got, my particular case, without giving it any thought at all. He just said, you know, and it is an option to do it. It sounds, um, it, it sounds aggressive to patients, mm -hmm. but if I were sitting where you were, I would do this. So you take the entire colon out and you connect the, the small bowel to the rectum. He's saying, take your whole colon out. Killian's like, whoa, 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 what's the problem with that? Like, what, what are the side effects of doing that? Why wouldn't everybody just do that? Are there implications in the future with that? No, there's actually not good ones. Well, the only issue is just the diarrhea issue. I mean, the, the rel not diarrhea, like the relative increase in bowel frequency. Mm -hmm. but, not, but if anything, there's a lot of positives. And he's like, oh, well, you know, other than the diarrhea. Oh, well, not diarrhea. I mean, you know, just like frequent poops that aren't hard. Like that's diarrhea. That's what that is. I'm not saying that I want to ever go to another music festival ever again, but if I had that done, I couldn't. Because I'd have to take anywhere from three to five poops that day. I hate music festivals. But I was like, what if I want to go to Coachella? How am I going to poop there? I was making excuses for him, and I shouldn't have been. Honestly, if I was like buying a car, and the guy who was selling the cars was like, well, this is the car I would drive, I would take their advice. You know, it's very... That's what I would do. Exactly, exactly. That's, that's what I'm saying. Like, that's what I would do. But the only reason I bring it up is that it sounds very, you know... That sounds aggressive. aggressive for yeah. I should have been like, you know what? You need to stop. Look at, look at what the other doctor sent you, and then give me a call on Monday, and then we can figure this out. But I also got lucky because had he not been so, you know, without trying to throw shade, had he not appeared so unprofessional, I would have probably gone with him and not gone to the doctor that I went to, and that's the doctor that I like better. And not only did he say that I probably shouldn't have my entire colon removed, but he's like, you've been seeing this guy for three years for basically rectal bleeding, and he's never once suggested that you get a colonoscopy. Thank <laughs> you.